wireless earbuds powered by light. Welcome back to Textination. I'm Fred Fishkin. Joining us from Urbanista is brand and marketing director Tuomas Lonka. Thanks for joining us, Tuomas. Thanks. Uh, thanks. Very nice to be here. Well, you have some great new innovations we'll be talking about. But first, let's chat a little bit about the background of Urbanista based in Sweden and some of the things that set you apart. Yeah, so we are uh, what we call ourselves a lifestyle audio company. So we make lifestyle audio products for for uh, young, active consumers who are looking for audio products, headphones, earphones, speakers that not only sound great, which is probably what you want from a from from an audio product that you use every day, but also that look good. So we're based here in Stockholm, Sweden, and um, and we operate globally across 90 markets. And the different uh, earphones, headphones that you have are are named after cities around the world, aren't they? Yeah, that's correct. So historically, we've always named the uh, named the products after different cities, and I, I think it's like uh, the cities are like a source of inspiration for us as uh, making these products. So typically, we try to find a product idea or a concept and uh, usually we kind of bring together the visual aspects of designing a product and also the the technical aspects like features and specs together into a, a product that in a consumer's mind it should make perfect sense why a product is named after los angeles or or phoenix or or seoul even and what's brand new are the phoenix earbuds so tell and these are the first solar powered earbuds tell us about this yeah so urbanista phoenix is a product that we just just announced uh, about a day ago officially so it is the world's first solar powered uh, true wireless earbuds using power foil solar cell technology so the the product is a collaboration between two Swedish companies, uh, Urbanista, obviously, uh, we're the manufacturer of the product, and then Exeter, who are a deep tech uh, startup developing a, a very innovative advanced solar cell technology that you can use even in audio products like this. So it's not the earbuds themselves that that have the 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 solar coating or whatever the panel on it, right? Tell us tell us how this is going to work. Yeah. So the how, how, how the product works basically is that the product has a case. It's a very pocket friendly, uh, very ergonomically designed case as you need one for, for charging uh, earbuds typically, but the case has a, has a power foil solar cell. And uh, basically the cell in the, in the case is constantly charging. So when you use the product, as long as you remember to put the buds in the case between use, uh, you can practically get endless playtime. So the, the case will constantly be charging. You should never practically need to plug it in into a, a USB outlet or a power outlet. Although I assume there is a, a USB port there, right? Yeah, there is a Type-C USB port just in case you would need it for, for any charging. If, if you would be in low light conditions, for example, for a long time or have the case in, in your backpack or, or things like this, which are quite common when you have a, a mobile product like this. Let's hope you don't stay in the dark for too long. So, But this will this will charge even in room light, correct? Not just in the sun. That's correct. So what makes a PowerFoil a very special technology in terms of solar cells is that it provides this type of features that it, it really does work in both indoor and outdoor light. And this is now the second product that we've done with this technology. The first one was Los Angeles headphones, which uh, which do the same thing. So it's quite quite, quite advanced technology for, for audio products. It's the first time that somebody is doing it at this level. That's, that's a very exciting. So how much does it add to the cost to to use the the power foil? Fortunately, that's not something that I, I go into, but but uh, but it is you know these products are at the cost level of of reasonable prices for for products like this, especially if you look at the the Phoenix model, which is one hundred and forty nine dollars is the retail price that we we have uh, announced it with. So it is a very competitive set of features that you get. Uh, if you consider that you have solar charging, 
uh, or solar and ambient light charging. You have hybrid active noise cancelling. Uh, you have noise reduction microphones, multipoint connectivity. So it's it's a lot of latest features that you, you get for a price of 149. Sounds like some terrific features. And when will they be available? You've announced them, but when can people buy? They will be available later this year. So um, soon, very soon. You have some other, uh, a lot of other, I guess, models on the market today, including one that's fairly new, the Soul. Tell us about that. This is aimed at gamers? That's correct. So Urbanista Soul is our first uh, go at a mobile gaming product. So it's a, it's a mobile gaming earphones, which are basically designed with the, with the mobile gamer in mind. So the product has a low latency gaming mode, which uh, if you're playing games which kind of require quick reaction time or or you need kind of like that that low latency connection between the audio and the the video this is a perfect product for that yeah and very often i think uh serious gamers anyway that uh, that uh, latency is is all important it's very important if you're a professional gamer you, you see a lot of people still are wearing uh, wired headsets uh, when when they're playing but this is more for the, I would say, a little bit more for the casual, casual gamer or or the competitive mobile gaming gaming players because those uh, those those people are out there too. Terrific. What else is new from the company? You're always busy. Yeah, we we have launched a lot of lot of products throughout the the, the last year or so. We also have a, a product called Miami, which is a, an ANC noise canceling uh, headphones that we launched earlier in, in 2021. So, so there is a there is a lot of lot of things always happening at Urbanistan. It's a very competitive uh, market. Uh, there is a lot of lot of uh, competitors. There is a lot of competition. New technology coming in constantly. So we're always working on new things. Well, that said, what is it that you want consumers to think of when they hear the name Urbanista? What I would say is that, like I mentioned in the beginning when we started, is that uh, what, how we see ourselves, we see Urbanista as a, as a lifestyle brand or a lifestyle audio company. So we try to create the products with, uh, with sort of a design in mind in terms of color and, and also like the visual aspect of the product is very important to our customers. So Urbanista kind of, I hope in the consumer's minds, uh, it, it comes off as a brand that sort of lives somewhere in the, in the intersection of fashion, technology, and innovation. Wonderful. And I guess there's no shortage of cities. So you've got a lot of names to, to turn to in the future as well, right? That is true. And we're always, always looking at new, new ideas and new sources of inspiration. So, so, um, but yeah, it's, it's a fantastic way for us to work together and kind of visualize, create this sort of urbanista perspective into the world and these cities that we portray with products. Tell us about availability, where, where your products are available. Yeah. So, uh, urbanista products are, sold across 90 markets worldwide uh, around 30,000 uh, points of sale so physical stores and then of course you can buy our products also online so at urbanista.com and uh, and at multiple online retailers such as Amazon for example once again the website is urbanista.com just like it sounds Tuomas Lanka thank you so much for taking the time with us thank you <laughs>